Hey guys, it's Abby here back with another video. It has been a while since I've done one of these. <laughs> so this year I think I really found my style and what things work for me. So I don't know, I'm just, I'm excited to show that off. Furthermore, these are my best thrift finds of 2020. So we are starting off strong by looking at this amazing coat. I live in Texas, so do I get to use her much? No. So this is the coat. It's very nice. I love this design right here. I think they're parallelograms or something. I don't, I don't really know, but they're really cool. And it's very insulated on the inside. And yeah, it's, it's very nice. I'm excited. They're by a brand called Lillian Lauro designs and yeah next on the list we have this beautiful skirt and when i tell you i've been wearing this so much i love her <laughs> it's just a regular long skirt it goes between three fabrics, which I think is really cool. It goes from a regular fabric to a more satin and then velvet. So it just goes between those. And I think it gives it a lot of texture and just coolness factor to a thousand. So yeah, this is by Nada Valley Petites. And yeah, if you want to see the tag, By the way, I'm going to do clothes first and then I'm going to go into objects and fabrics and stuff that I found. Stay until the end if you want to see some cool home decor items, some cool, I don't know, I have jewelry and shoes and stuff. Anyways, on to the next thing. Um, there is this long sleeve shirt that I really like. I really love the color, the design, just all about it is really nice. I don't know if you can really see that well, but yeah, it's a little bit see-through. Not in the front, it has a fabric layer there, but in the arms and the back it does. Um, I really like the neckline. It, I think that looks really cool. You'll see it better in the clip afterwards. I like how they kind of have that bell-bottom type look, but in the sleeves, I think that's really pretty every time clothes have that. It's very witchy and stuff. I, I really want to put a lookbook together with all of these, so if you want that, you know, comment down below, like, do all of those, share, I don't know. <laughs> Next, we have yet another jacket. Uh, this one is really cool. I I like it because it's better for Texas weather. It has the denim neck uh, collars and it has a lot of really, really cool patchwork in it. And I think it looks really cool. It also has these denim patchwork pockets in the, in the front. I don't know. That it's just really nice. Oh, in the back here, let me show that. It's just more patchwork. I, I really love this. I want to just like put flowers in the front pockets and go, then go shopping at a fruit market or something. That's what, that's the vibe this gives off and I really like it. Oh, and I almost forgot. The tag is from Tantrums, which is really cool. I really like the tag as well. It looks, it looks really pretty. <laughs> I forgot to show the tag of the other one, so I'll show that right now. It's from Wrapper. That's the, that's the tag brand, so I don't know if you want to go looking for that. <laughs> Next is very like very top tier i love this so much i just got it the other day and it is a corset top 
Wait, is this the front or the back? Oh my god, it's inside out. Hold on. Okay, here it is. <laughs> so, I think this is really, really cool. Um, I love corset tops. I love corsets. I love all those, so, like, a lot. <laughs> and this one just looks really cool. It has an older look to it. And then at the bottom, it has all these really cool things. I'm not, I don't know. Just like the little, little fringe. I think it looks really cool. And it adds a like I said, more texture to it. Just a lot more, I don't know, it gives it an interesting look and I really like that. The zipper is in the back as well, so you can easily get into it and it's not as constraining as most corset tops or corsets, of course. So this will be the last coat I'll be showing off, but it's a good one. I look like I skinned a vintage teddy bear to make this. She is gorgeous. She smells really bad. Like it's that musty, been in an attic for 50 years scent, but it's worth it, honestly. <laughs> the lace is probably my favorite part. I just love lace on anything. It's just really nice. The brand for this is Silver Kiss. And that's what it says on there. So next we have this really cool dress. I'm not sure if it's vintage lingerie or if it's vintage, like a vintage wedding dress. I don't, I don't know what this is for, but it's so pretty. Okay, let me let me let me show it off. So this is the top part of it. It has all this really cool detailing, and I really love the little rose on it. It's I don't know. I think it's very pretty. It's about um, to the knee, maybe a little more downwards, but I don't know. I think it's just really pretty, and I think it fits me pretty well. So that's always good. Here's the brand. It's Amelia's. Next, here is a really cool other corset top. So this one had like the little boob pad thingies, but I really didn't like that, so I just cut them out. It's a little statement piece and I really like that. Um, so yeah, and here's, here's the back. I don't know if I showed it on the next clip or not, but yeah, they don't lace up. So I don't know if that's technically a corset or not, but they do like these little just like the little bra, kind of like the bra things, you know? So it's pretty cool. Lastly, for the clothing, I have this really cool crochet top. Um, I don't know, I just think it's very nice. It's a really good cover up for like bathing suits, like tank tops or whatever, I don't know. It's just really nice. The brand is KSL, division of Karen Stevens. Next, I have these two really cool belts that I have thrifted. Um, there's this one. It has stars all over it and I just think it's really nice. I couldn't try it on because it started getting dark outside and that's where I was taking my pictures. So just imagine that on a person <laughs> and then with all of this. I might even do it like this part in the back with these up front because I think these are really the star of the show, you know? So there's that one. And then the other one, this one is my favorite one. I feel so cool in this. So I, it has like all these pretty little gems on it. 
and I think it looks really cool. I love this little one on the end as well. It's pretty cool. It looks like an apple kind of, <laughs> but it just ties like this. I wouldn't say ties, but you know, it goes to whichever one fits you well. And this one hangs off a little bit. It's pretty cool. So I really like that. Next, we have these really cool gloves. I have them in black as well, but I don't know where they are at the moment. My mom actually got these from Goodwill and gave them to me for Christmas, so that's really cool. With a pandemic happening right now, I think it would be a really cool idea to bring back those luxurious gloves. I think that would look really cool, so. Yes. I really only bought one pair of shoes from Goodwill that I was like, wow, these are really, really cool. And there are these ones. They're not much, I mean, there's there's not much to them. I just think they're, they're a staple for any outfit. Now I'm going to show off all the really cool jewelry I got. There's a lot of jewelry, so I'm just, I'm just gonna go straight into it. Um, first of all, this really pretty brooch. I think this is so interesting here. I don't know if I don't know if you can see it that well. I think you can see a little better in the clip I'm going to show next. But I it's just so pretty. It has this little cherub right here and then it has another cherub with an arrow and then it has this really cool locket. I haven't put anything in there yet and I honestly can't really open it because I don't have nails. I just think it's really pretty and I want to put my corset so So next, I have these really pretty earrings. Um, they're very vintage, very, well, I don't know if they're actually vintage, but very vintage looking. I haven't seen many things like this, so yeah, they're really cool. Then we have these bunny earrings. I think these are so cute. These are so heavy. I didn't think they would be as heavy as they actually are. But here, I like the, I like them going towards each other. <laughs> Look, they're kissing. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, they have like the little diamond like diamond looking eyes and they're really they're really cool. Uh, then I have these really cool cross earrings. They're just like these little crosses and they have butterflies and flowers all in the cross. And I just think they look really interesting. So yeah. So then there are these really cool earrings. I really love whatever is in the middle, like whichever rock. I love the edges as well, or like the border. These last earrings are my absolute favorite. They are so heavy. <laughs> they are, oh my God, they're beautiful though. I love these so much. I can only wear them for like an hour at a time, but they're, they're just really pretty. I love the green in the middle. I love the color green. It has like that interesting backing that doesn't look, I don't like things that look absolutely perfect. Um, you know, I like things with flaws and you know, it's very bumpy in the back and it shows, it shows character. I like it, <laughs> but they jingle a little bit. So that's cool. Um, yeah, these are easily my favorite. They're, they're really cool. <laughs> I also have just this really cool purse. Um, I've been wearing this nonstop. I just think it's really cool. It has that iridescent material or uh, fabric that I really, really like. And has all these really pretty flowers and little like flower petals or leaves or whatever. I just think it's really interesting. It has a lot of really cool beading and has beading all up this right here that's it for that one <laughs> next we're on to more of the items instead of the clothing so i'm just gonna go into this uh i'm starting out with fabric this awesome fabric i oh i found this at my local thrift shop um it just has so many interesting things on it it's just everywhere you look it's something different there are all kinds of animals and all all kinds of landscapes, 
people, just all kinds of really cool stuff. Um, a bunch of beautiful flowers and this is a good chunk of fabric as well. So I really, I'm really excited to make something out of that. I'm, I wanna start making more sewing videos and this will definitely be in the next one. So check out for that. <laughs> then another thing with fabric, this, it's like a bed sheet, but it doesn't fit on my bed. So I think I'm just going to use it as fabric. But it has a bunch of suns and moons and cool little swirly things or whatever. And I just think it looks really cool. To my fabric drawer it goes. <laughs> I don't know, I also have just like a bunch of random things like this really cool vase. Um, I have a few other little things around that I just didn't feel like bringing over. So just a lot of like glass thingies. I don't know. Cool vase. And then this these really cool picture frames i love these so much i have a picture from austria and this one it has like all these really cool detailings right here and just i don't know it just looks very pretty and then i found this one to match um here's like i don't know it's just a picture with me and my boyfriend but it has like all these really pretty things down here last but definitely not least i found this beautiful little box from 1988 it says on the little, little tag but i think it looks so pretty it has like a little angel right here um has all these pretty details um it has cherubs i don't know cherubs angels i don't really know the difference but i don't know it just looks beautiful i have a lot of my resin stuff in here but I don't know, it just has all kinds of little things on it. And it just looks very interesting and I really love I really love the designs. It just adds a little bit of spice to the modernness of our world, you know? So Yeah. <laughs> okay guys, that's all for today. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you for supporting me and my YouTube videos and just all of that. Um I am definitely thinking of posting more interesting content soon. You know, a lot of sewing stuff or just different things like that. So if you're interested in watching that, please subscribe. And if you wouldn't mind liking this video and sharing it with a few friends or commenting something, I would really appreciate it. Once again, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Goodbye.